Welcome to this combined UK drug testing and value med presentation video showing you the all test dip cannabis test strip. The foil that you will receive is the standard all test branded foil that contains a single test strip and here is the example cannabis test strip that's been removed from that foil. There will also be a little pad of desiccant inside the foil to keep this in good condition. THC on the handle end is the coding of the drug test that you've purchased. Also on the reverse of the foil, if I just show you the standard certification markings, it will be again the repeat coding THC with the sensitivity here at 50, rapid test, dipstick, urine. There is a lot number, a coding for the product which is used internally for the catalogue and an expiry date. This will obviously vary depending on the batch that you've purchased. Remove the test strip just before you're ready to perform the test and do so on a fresh sample of urine that's been collected. We've got a synthetic urine here that we're going to demonstrate how to do that. Holding the handle end of the dip test, just dip it. You'll just see that that is going to just below the maximum dip level as indicated by the max and arrows on the dip end of this test strip. And you'll start to see in the central portion the dye starting to run in this lateral flow test. After about 10 seconds, just remove the test strip from the urine sample, which can now be removed, and lay the test flat, ideally on the floor, on the foil, and allow it to run for the specified read time on the test strip instructions. For this test, for an all negative test, or a positive test, you will have varying time frames to work to. On an all negative test, as you can see developing here, are both the control line showing very strongly and a fainter test line already showing despite the pink dye still being in the test zone of the test strip. For a positive test, to interpret that correctly, you must wait for the complete development time as specified in the instructions. But if you're getting two test lines at an early stage, that is a clear negative result. The other advice we emphasize always is that the test line will vary in thickness, color density and saturation. It does not matter how thin or faint the test line is. If it is showing at the correct read time in the presence of a control line, that is a clear negative result and that the drug has not been detected at or above the cutoff level as indicated on the test strip. Thanks for watching.